Let's get our hearts ready. Let's praise this one together. I have found a friend in Jesus. I have found a friend in Jesus. He's everything to me. He's the fairest of 10,000 to my soul. The lily of the valley, in him alone I see. All I need to cleanse and make me fully whole. In sorrow is my comfort, in trouble is my stay. He tells me every care on him to roll the lily of the valley the bright and morning star he's the fairest of ten thousand to my song he all my grief has taken and all my sorrows born and temptation is strong and mighty time I have all for him forsaken, and all my idols torn from my heart, and now he keeps me by his power. Though all the world forsake me, and Satan tempts me sore, through Jesus I shall safely reach the goal. He's the lily of the valley, the bright and morning star. He's the fairest of ten thousand to my soul. He will never, never leave me, nor yet forsake me. While I live by faith and do His blessed will. Oh, all the fire about me, I've nothing now to fear. With this manna, he my hungry soul shall fill. Then sweeping up to glory to see his blessed face, where rivers of delight shall ever roll. He's the lily of the valley, the bright and morning star. He's the fairest of thousand to my soul is the lily of the valley the bright and morning star he's the fairest of ten thousand to my soul amen okay jesus is the christ the answer to all problems okay May we be able to know and learn and be able to put inside of our lives what is most important, okay? May we be able to know correctly, accurately, right, what the world teaches and discern how much more the gospel is so much more important, okay? How the gospel is so much more greater than all things, okay? So on this Friday worship, Okay, may our hearts, may our minds be filled with the Holy Spirit so that our lives would be centered upon what God wants. Okay, so let's all stand up. Let's praise these next ones together, okay? Jesus answered, I am the way. Jesus answered, I am the way, I am the truth and the life. I am the way, truth and life. No one comes to the Father except through only me. There's no other way to make judge. Jesus, Jesus answered, I am the way, I am the truth and the life. I'm the way, truth and life. No one comes to the Father except through only me. There's no other way to meet God. Oh, I want to follow my Lord Jesus, who is the way to life. Oh, I want to give my praise to Jesus, is the truth and life. Jesus answered, I am the way, I am the truth and the life, I'm the way, truth and life. No one comes to the Father except through only me. There's no other way to meet God. Oh, I want to give my flight. 
Jesus is way to life. All I want to give my praise to Jesus. He's the truth and life. Yeah, Jesus answered, I am the way, I am the truth and the life. I'm the way, truth and life. No one comes to the Father except through only me. There's no other way to all. I want to follow my Lord Jesus, who is the way to life. Oh, I want to give my praise to Jesus, is the truth and life. Jesus answered, I am the way, I am the truth and the life. I'm the way, truth and life. No one comes to the Father except through only me. There's no other way to me. God. All right, here we go. The King of Kings who came to crush the devil's power. Oh, I'm so sorry. That's so wrong. The King of Kings who came to crush the devil's power. Is that right? Is that the right key? I think so. Let's just start from the top. All right, Jesus, he is. Jesus, he is the Christ. He's the answer to everything. Jesus, he is the Christ. Let us tell it to the world. Jesus, he is. Jesus, he is the Christ. He's the answer to everything. Jesus, he is the Christ. Let us tell it to the world. The King of kings who came to crush the devil's power. The Lord, the Lord, who is the only way to God. The Lamb of God, who free from sin and death. Let us thank Him, let us praise Him, proclaim to all. Jesus, He is the Christ, He's the answer to everything. Jesus, He is the Christ, let us tell it to the world. The King of kings, the King of kings who came to crush the devil's power. The Lord, the Lord, who is the only way to God. The Lamb of God is set free from sin and death. Let us thank Him. Let us praise Him, proclaim to all. Jesus, He is the Christ. He's the answer to everything. Jesus, He is the Christ. Let us tell it. All right, let me hear you. The King of kings who came. The Lamb of God is set us free from sin and death. Let us thank Him, let us praise Him, proclaim to all. Jesus, He is the Christ, He's the answer to everything. Jesus, He is the Christ, let us tell it. To the world. Amen. Let's sit down. Let this worship be lifted unto you. Let this praise we sing unto you. Let this prayer we give unto you be your pleasing 
sake sacrifice to you let this worship be lifted unto you let this praise be sing unto you let this prayer we give unto you be a pleasing sacrifice to you the holy spirit reigns over us heaven angels are surrounding us the word of god is proclaimed unto us to the word of god we sing amen the holy spirit reigns over us heavenly angels are surrounding us the word of god is proclaimed unto us to the word of god we sing amen to the word of god we sing amen to the word of god we sing amen Seek ye first the kingdom of God and His righteousness, and all these things shall be added unto you. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Seek ye first, seek ye first the kingdom of God and His righteousness. And all these things shall be added unto you. Hallelujah, hallelujah. to you seek and you shall find knock and the door shall be open unto you Oh, man. 
Let's pray. God, we thank you so much. May we be about to enjoy to the fullest the blessings that come from your throne, Lord. Uh, knowing who uh, you are, knowing uh, that you are the God of the covenant, God, may we be about to accurately know what it is uh, that you have been uh, constantly proclaiming to us through this gospel, Lord. Uh, God, this world continues to uh, this world continues to teach and to continues uh, continues to influence. Uh, through the snares and traps of Satan, Lord. But God, may we be able to have the spiritual strength, the blessings to be able to overcome and transcend all things uh, because we know that your gospel is everything, Lord. To us, may we be able to enjoy to the fullest uh, your blessing of Emmanuel, this blessing of worship. Guard our hearts and our minds. May we be able to truly succeed in worship today. We thank you. We love you. and pray all these things in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Let's confess together the Apostles' Creed. I believe in God the Father Almighty, the creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, God's only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, and was crucified, dead, and buried. On the third day, he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven. He is seated at the right hand of the Father, where he'll come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Universal Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. In Jesus Christ's name we pray. Amen. Uh, the, the church that has peace and is being built up firmly. Let's have a healthy spiritual state that succeeds in worship. Spiritual state that fears the Lord. Correctly understand. Spiritual state that obeys God's word. Spiritual state encouraged by the Holy Spirit or comforted by the Holy Spirit, not the things of the world, but from above. And trying God and His Word. 27 courtyard of the Gentiles. You go make disciples of all nations. Help them root down into church. With us always. Healing courtyard of prayer. God answers our prayers because He's our daddy. Receive spiritual healing through the filling of the Holy Spirit. Summit, courtyard of the children. Save the future generations, posterity. Let's love the Lord first. Faith and skill. Let's hold on to God's word and pray. Experience working of the Holy Spirit. Testify uniqueness of Christ, which is happening to me in my field. Are you experiencing it? Yeah. Today's message is the perspective of only. The perspective. Point of view. The perspective of only. Only Jesus. All done? Yeah. Acts 26, 25, 28, 29. I can't breathe. Three, two, one. But Paul answered, I'm not insane, most excellent Festus. I'm speaking words of truth and sobriety. Then Agrippa said to Paul, Can you persuade me in such a short time to become a Christian? Paul replied, short time or long, I pray God that not only you, but all who are listening to me today may become what I am, except for these chains. So the question of the day, what do I see as the answer? Echo, echo, echo. What do I see as the answer? What's the answer? Para tu. For you. Done. Moving on. The perspective of only. Paul knew that the answer is only Christ. Do you? Paul before Agrippa. 
Agrippa said to Paul, you have permission to speak for yourself. Then Paul stretched out his hand and began his defense. I think myself happy, King Agrippa, that I am not making my defense before you this day concerning all the things that I am accused by the Jews. So hear me out, guys. I beg you, listen to me carefully. Surely all the Jews know how I have lived from the earliest days of my youth among all my own people and in Jerusalem. Go pro. They've known me for a long time, and they could, they could prove, they could testify if they're willing to, that I lived as a Pharisee. Can you see? I can see. Pharisee. And now I stand on trial because of my hope in the promise that God made to our fathers. The problem is our 12 tribes are hoping to realize as they earnestly serve God day and night. It's because of this hope, O king, that I am accused by the Jews. Hope. What the hope? Why would any of you consider it incredible that God raises the dead? God's all powerful. Of course he could do this. Is it shocking? So then I too was convinced that I ought to do all that I could to oppose the name of the Jesus of Nazareth. I also persecuted the Christians. And this is what I did in Jerusalem. With authority from the chief priests, I put many of the saints in prison. And when they were condemned to death, I cast my vote against them. I frequently had them punished in the synagogue, and I tried to make them blasphemy in my raging fury against them. I even went to foreign cities to persecute them. Wow, jungle. In this pursuit, I was on my way to Damascus with the authority and commission of the chief priests. But about noon, O oh king, as I was on the road, I saw a light from heaven, brighter than the sun, shining around me with, and my companions. I fell to the ground and heard a voice say to me in Hebrew, Saul, Saul, why do you persecute me? It's hard for you to kick against the goats. Who are you, Lord? I asked. I am Jesus, whom you are persecuting, the Lord replied. But get up and stand on your feet, for I have appeared to you to appoint you as a servant and as a witness of what you have seen from me and what I will show you. I will rescue you from your own people. But from the Gentiles, I'm sending you to them. Sending in three. Two, one, blast off. To open their eyes so they may turn from darkness to light, from the power of Satan to God, that they may receive forgiveness of sins and an inheritance among those who are sanctified by faith in me, Jesus, the true prophet, the true priest, and the true king. The way of salvation. So then, King Agrippa, I was not disobedient to the heavenly vision. Oh, no, 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 no. First to those in Damascus and in Jerusalem, then to everyone in the region of Judea, and then to the Gentiles, I, I declared that they should repent and turn to God, performing deeds worthy of their repentance. Now, for this reason, the Jews seized me in the temple course and tried to kill me. But I have, a, I have God's help to this day, and I stand here to testify, five, 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 to small and great alike. I am saying nothing beyond what the prophets and Moses said. Jesus is the Christ, only Jesus, that the Christ would suffer and as the first to rise from the dead will proclaim light to our people and to the Gentiles. Jesus is the Christ, 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 Jesus is the Christ. At this point, Festus interrupted Paul's defense. You are out of your mind, Paul, he shouted. Are you out of your mind? Are you un poco loco? Are you poco loco? Yes. Spanx. <laughs> Paul, are you insane? Your, your great learning is driving you insane. Insane in the membrane. Insane in the membrane. Insane in the membrane. Insane in the brain. But Paul answered, I am not insane, most excellent Festus. 
I am speaking words of truth. The king is familiar with these things, and I can speak freely to him. I'm convinced that none of these, none of this has escaped his notice because it was not done in, the, in a corner. You know, hey, King Agrippa, Agrippa, do you believe the prophets? I know you do. He's like, yeah, I know about the prophets. There's that one and that one and that one and that one. I don't know why that one's naked, <laughs> but that one too. Then Agrippa said, Paul, you think you could persuade me in such a short time to become a Christian? Convince me if you can. Paul replied, hey, short time or long time? I pray to God that not only you, but all who are listening to me today may become what I am, a saved child of God. I'm not talking about these chains. I'm not talking about a prisoner. A safe child of God. Uh. All right. Then the king and the governor rose. Everybody rise. Three, two, one, go. Except for teacher Christina. <laughs> Stay, risen. Then the king and the governor rose, along with Bernice, which is a queen, and the, all those seated with them. You may be seated. The court is adjourned. On their way out, they said to one another, this man has done nothing worthy of death or imprisonment. Place look familiar? It's Fairview Elementary School. Yeah, it is. And Agrippa said to Festus, This man could have been released if he had not appealed to Caesar. Do not be afraid, you must stand trial before Caesar. Paul 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 appealed to Caesar. Ah, he should have he should have just he should have just told the truth and he should have been released. He could have just told the truth and he could have been released. He would have just told the truth and he would have been released. Shoulda, woulda, coulda. Hey, he shoulda, woulda, coulda. Well, Paul had the eyes to see the world. May we have the eyes to see the world. I said correctly. You wrote this down already? What's in next to teacher Christina? Get it together. And get a new notebook. What is that? It's been through a war zone. Coulda, woulda, shoulda. The eyes to see the world. Well, let's take a look at the world. What? Hey, I, mean, I was doing bass fishing. You're doing a little, little bluegill fishing. Bluegill easy. You just put it in and then it just comes out. Little baby hooks. Hey, man, bass. Oh, rock bass. Whoa, rock bass. The eyes to see the world. The world dying. The world covered in darkness. Because the world separated from God. Everyone's born separated from God. Doesn't matter how rich, how poor, how strong, how weak. Doesn't matter if you're born with three arms, one arm, two arms, two heads. Separated from God. It's original sin. That's a, that's a curse of sin. The whole world, physical. They only care about food, clothes, shelter. That's it. Family. That's it. Whole world only cares about 
Success. Doesn't matter how you get it, just be successful. Cheat, be successful. Betray other people, be successful. Kick, on, kick people under the bus, which is another word of betraying people. Successful. Lie to be successful. Are you kidding me right now? The whole world, culture of darkness. Culture of darkness. The whole world, it's all about worldly knowledge. Language, community, values, food and drinks. The arts, movies, music, art, technology, techno techniques, skills, traditions, rituals, all culture of darkness, all culture of being of separated from God. Can't you see? The whole world, oh, listening to the words of the world. The more you listen to the words of the world, you're just being blinded by darkness again. We should listen to God's word, not the words of people. The whole world, worshiping idols, people worshiping idols. What, 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 did, what did God say about worshiping idols? Don't do that, or else the curse will go to the third and fourth generations. What the heck? The whole world, people born separated from God, which means they're born as children of Satan. Oh, but, but what about the cute little babies? Born, no, they're born with original sin. This is spiritual facts. Suffer under spiritual problems. Empty, empty. They're trying to seek happiness. People are seeking, people are still looking. We have the light, so people will come to us. Hello. Like the Tin Man. Have you ever seen a Wizard of Oz? Yeah, the... Empty. He's a Tin Man. He's looking, the whole, the whole movie is him trying to look for a heart. Yeah. Empty. The Tin Man. A heart, because he has no heart. Mental problems. So, which is why people go to therapy, they go to psychiatrists, they go to psychologists. Psychiatry, therapist, yeah. But can, can people solve the problem of original sin? They can't solve spiritual problems. Maybe they could solve physical and mental problems, but they can't solve spiritual problems. It's all a big hoax. Oh, yeah, good time to do that, Benji. Oh, Physical problems. <laughs> physical problems, right? Repeating incurable physical problems. No matter how much you adjust your neck, adjust your back, it's just constant physical problems. Family problems, going to the fourth, third and fourth generations of those who disobey God. Grandma, a great grandma, problem. Grandma, pro same problem. Mother, problem. Daughter, same problem. What the? And in the end, hell. And they live their entire life as if it was hell. Don't be tricked. People just trick you. The world is tricking you. Right? Oh, the world is happiness. One remnant was talking about Michael Jackson today. Right? Michael Jackson. Yeah, he's all fancy. He's rich. He has mansion. He has all the money he could ever imagine. However, depression. And some, he can't sleep. So he took medicine and he passed away. What is your proof? Okay, that's conspiracy theory. Conspiracy theory. Oh, okay, yeah, keep, keep diving into those videos instead of listening to God's word. Waste time, yeah, go waste time. This is the same remnant who said, no, 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 teacher Ginster, Pastor Sal, George Washington is still alive. What the, what are you talking about? Mental problem, mental problem. What is my perspective? What's my perspective of all me? 
How do I see only? All right, Michael. You you sleep on you sleep on the you sleep on the floor. All right. If you want to expose, Michael never took a shower during the church retreat. <laughs> Nor did he brush his teeth. What? Nor change his socks. I'm just I'm just saying. When you see depressed people, sad people, what, what do they need? Jesus. Only Jesus. Only Jesus. What about if you see angry people? Angry all the time. Angry, angry. Arr. I hate the world. I hate people. What do they need? No, only Jesus. What about all oh, super excited people? Oh, I'm so excited about my life, my career. No, only Jesus. What about... Uh, Oh, happy couple, happy family, Woo, new couple, newly married, only Jesus. What about oh, stressed, confused people about to lose their mind, only Jesus. What about uh, depressed people that give up, I'm burnt out, what do they need? Only Jesus. What about anxious people, always worried all the time? Oh, oh, what if this happens? What if that happens? Oh, oh. What do they need? Only. Only Jesus. Only Jesus. That's the answer. How about a, a businessman, CEO, rich, successful? What do they need? Only, oh, only Jesus. Doesn't matter. What about a cashier, a cashier at Aldi, or Costco, or Walmart, at Sonic, at the gas station, 7-Eleven, 9-Eleven? What do they need? Only Jesus. What about a chef? Chef. People working at restaurant. Who do they need? Only Jesus. What about soldiers, general, commanders, guards, national guard, marines? Only Jesus. Doesn't matter. What about nurses, or, or doctor, dentists? What do they need? Only Jesus. What about? Construction workers. Construction workers. Only Jesus. Doesn't matter. What about teachers? What do teachers need? Okay. Close your eyes. Think of all the teachers that come to mind. Three, two, one, go. What do they need? Only Jesus. Only Jesus. What about homeless people? People in the streets? Lazarus. All the Lazaruses. What do they need? Only Jesus. Can you see your perspective of only? Doesn't matter who. How about the president? Who keeps falling on the stage for some reason? What, or on his bike. What does he need? Only Jesus. So that's our perspective. What's the answer for everything or for everyone? Only Jesus. That's, that. that's it, right? Do, do, do people need anything else? No. Everything's in only Jesus. Do you believe that? Amen. Culture time. Well, class of 2023, uh, they graduated uh, in Chicago. They graduated today. People were very sad. People were happy. I almost cried. I'm just kidding. I didn't cry. But then these are like even like families of athletes that I had. I had their sibling. 
and then I had their second sibling, and now the third sibling I had ever since like fourth grade, and then she graduated today. And then the family came and gave me gifts, and they were they hugged me and all that. I gave joyful gifts to eighth graders, who God moved my heart to give to them. And these are, yeah, oh for sure, yeah. She I, she needs gospel <laughs> only Jesus. What prom girl? No, I gave her a medal, a medal and joyful gift. Yeah, only Jesus. Because these are eighth graders or high schoolers or college graduates that are moving on to the next chapter of their life, right? And then you guys all are all going to the next grade. That's the next chapter of your life in your covenant journey. What page? Probably on like page 13. Hey Amen. For you, maybe page 876, almost the end. Oh, close to the close to the index, buddy. Wow. Okay. Well, may you take the next step on your covenant journey, holding on to only Jesus. Homework. Homework is. There was no homework. But if you did, if you didn't do jam board, your jelly jam, you could finish that up. This is probably the guy who said George Washington was alive. That's probably the guy who said Michael Jackson is alive. That's probably the guy who only brought one pair of socks and underpants to the church retreat. I would like to speak to you later. Let us pray for France and the Isle of Man. I don't know. So France, majority Catholicism. The Isle of Man, Anglican Christian. Wow. What's Anglican? Christian. A branch of Christianity. Let us pray for these two nations. Three, two, one. Dear God, may you bless France and the Isle of Man so that the gospel may enter and revive these nations. May disciples arise, shine the light of the gospel, and establish your kingdom there. In the name of Jesus Christ we pray. Amen. Dear God, may you bless our precious remnants. Help us to have the perspective of only Jesus. May only Jesus be the answer that we see that people need. Uh, help, and help us to relay this answer of only Jesus. And help us to need only Jesus. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Uh,